Hi guys, I hope all of you are doing absolutely great. My name is Arindam Roy Chaudhary and this is the first ever collaboration video on my channel and who better than Skanda Prasad. First of all, I congratulate Skanda Prasad on crossing 10,000 subscribers on his channel. I have given the link to his channel in the description. Kindly do subscribe him and he makes a lot of content related to KCT and Comet K. So please do the honors. Apart from this, we are going to talk about the top 25 colleges, engineering colleges in Karnataka. We all know about IIC Bangalore, the best institute of India. We all know about NIT Surat Kal, the only college which has a private beach for itself. But there are other colleges also in the Bengaluru as well as the Karnataka region. Okay, so Sanda is going to talk about everything. Okay, he himself studies at NIE, that is the National Institute of Engineering, Mysuru, and he knows a lot about this. He has a lot of background research. So please. Do the honors, please see the video till the end and he's going to take over from now. Hello everyone, I am Skanda Prasad, currently pursuing B.Tech in uh, National Institute of Engineering, Mysore, second year in Electronics and Communication Engineering. Firstly, I would like to thank Arindam for calling me on uh, the ARC community for talking about the best colleges uh, we can find in Karnataka. So here I am with this video. Let's begin with the top four colleges, uh, you know, which you can get through either J mains or advanced, uh, which are included in Karnataka. And then we'll talk about the colleges which will come, you know, uh, through uh, exams such as uh, Comet K and KCET, as well as uh, this one uh, college called as PES University, which takes through the exam called as PESAT. I shall talk about, uh, I shall talk more about it later on. So let's first talk about the first five colleges. Uh, did I say four? I'm sorry. So five colleges, the first one being IIC Bangalore, that is Indian Institute of Science Bangalore, which takes admission uh, basically uh, based on KV PY for uh, pure science fields. But uh, even there are, uh, you know, undergraduate courses for engineering too, which take uh, admissions through J main and J advanced. So this was IIC Bangalore at the first position. Next we have NITK Suratkal, that is National Institute of Technology Karnataka Suratkal in Mangalore, Karnataka. So this is yet another government of India, uh, you know, based college taking admissions for uh, UG, PG as well as uh, PhD programs. For UG, uh, the admission uh, is based on your J main score, that is uh, J main rank and uh, this was at second position. The next one we have is uh, IIIT Bangalore, that is International Institute of uh, Information Technology, Bangalore. Uh, please note, it's not Indian Institute of Information Technology, it is International Institute of Information Technology, Bangalore. Uh, very recently uh, established and uh, great for information technology courses and you know, computer science and engineering and um, uh, you know, moving its way to the top uh, very rapidly and uh, takes admissions uh, based on your J main score. And uh, next we have IIT Dharwad, uh, that is Indian Institute of Technology, uh, Dharwad, very new and uh, you know rising up slowly. So this was at fourth position and next we have MIT Manipal, that is Manipal Institute of Technology in Manipal, that is uh, near Udupi district and uh, it belongs to the uh, university called as Mahe, that is Manipal Academic, uh, Academy of Higher Education. So this was our top five colleges which you don't get through KCET and Comet K. And now let's talk about the colleges which come, uh, you know, through KCET as well as Comet K. I'm going to count backwards now. Uh, let me name a few colleges. I'll just name them with the top 10. I mean, sorry, the, you know, behind 10. And then we'll talk about totally about around uh, 25. Five colleges are done. Uh, next, we are remaining with the last 20. So I'll uh, start from the 20th position college that is RNSIT Bangalore. So this is at 20th position in uh, present in Bangalore. Uh, decent college with the decent placement records and uh, you can you know Google more about it. Uh, won't be talking much about that in this video. At 19th position we have Nitte Meenakshi Institute of uh, you know technology also present in Bangalore. Uh, decent college you know uh, never a bad option. So this was at 19th position at 18th position we have dr ambedkar institute of technology rising up through the ranks in uh, you know karnataka and uh, decent college you can choose if you are getting you know uh, rank suitable for that college next we have acharya institute of technology again a decent college and uh, pretty good placement records and uh, you know people do choose this uh, college next we have something very famous uh, you know Pesit South Campus, that is PES uh, Institute of Technology South Campus present in uh, Electronic City, Bangalore. So, uh, 
this was a part of you know uh, comes under even uh, ps university and uh, you know there are two different things one is ps university and the other one is peset south campus which is this one present in uh, electronic city a very good choice if you really want to go and uh, if you have a decent rank uh, you can uh, get into peset south campus next we have bnmit uh, that's also uh, another uh, college bnm institute of technology college in bangalore and uh, the next one comes is a CMR Institute of Technology. Uh, this was at uh, 2019, 18, 17, 16, 15. 14th position was uh, CMR Institute of Technology. Again, decent uh, reviews for this college. And uh, you know, this is all you can choose. These are the you know 11 to 20, those colleges. Next, we have New Horizon College of Engineering. Again, I won't be talking much about this. But uh, again, there are good reviews on uh, online. You can check more about them. Next, we have two colleges which have, you know, uh, suddenly made up a good name these days. That is BVB College of Engineering and Technology. This is in a city called as Hubbali, uh, present uh, near North Karnataka. So you can, uh, you know, uh, there are recently there are really, really good, uh, you know, work ethics of teachers. And then, you know, the vision of the visionary of the college is really, really good. And that's what I've heard. And the next one is Kaley Institute of Technology or they even call it uh, Kaley Technological University again. A really good one and uh, uh, very very positive reviews about this college too so this was our uh, 11th college now comes the top 10 the top uh, the 10th college which we are talking about is Dayanand Sagar College of Engineering also popularly known as DE DSCE it is a private uh, you know college and affiliated to uh, VTU that is Vishweshwaraya Technological University video affiliated and uh, granted autonomy also so you know things are run by the college itself and not video specifically the degree which you get uh, video affiliated uh, base basically means that your degree certificate if you pass out to this college will have the video seal that is Vishweshwaraya Technological University uh, a good university which is you know uh, recognized uh, almost all over the world too at ninth position we have SIT Tumkur that is Siddhaganga Institute of Technology present in a city called as Tumkur and uh, run by Sri Siddhaganga, Siddhaganga Educational Society provides you undergra undergraduate uh, courses in about 12 disciplines and again autonomous uh, and video affiliated college a really good choice if you really want to go there and a very very positive reviews I know a lot of people who are uh, who have studied there and very good placement record too a good choice at eighth position is uh, comes uh, the college known as NI Mysore that's where I study that is the National Institute of Engineering Mysore granted aut autonomy in uh, 2007 that is it is an autonomous private college VTU affiliated again and the uh, second oldest college in Karnataka which was established in 1946 and uh, by three retired engineers actually and it is the first ever engineering college in the city of Mysore that is heritage city of Mysore uh, very proud to uh, be from here and uh, the very notable alumni from this college that is NI Mysore is uh, our very own NR Narayan Murthy you know the, the chairman and uh, founder of uh, Infosys Limited so this was about NI Mysore that is at 8th position at 7th position we have BIT Bangalore that is Bangalore Institute of Technology Again, VTU affiliated college and it offers you nine undergraduate programs. And uh, the good thing about this is it uh, it has collaborations with institutes such as, such as IISC, which I mentioned earlier, and NAL, that is uh, National uh, Aerospace Laboratories. So uh, they have collaboration uh, with, uh, I mean, collaborated courses with these institutes also a very, very good choice. And uh, this was at seventh position. At sixth position, we do have... SJCE that is Sri Jayachamarajendra College of Engineering Mysore. Uh, now it's uh, you know affiliated to I mean it's at present known as JSS Science and Technological University and uh, an excellent placement record and supposed to be the best in uh, Mysore. You know there's always a, a neck up con uh, you know competition between NI and uh, JCE. Uh, SJC is also popularly known as JC. Uh, we say that way and uh, it's computer science and you know circuit branches in general computer science information science and uh, electrical as well as electronic and telecommunication i mean you know instrumentation engineering all of them come together and uh, they're known as circuit branches a highly excellent placement record in sjc mysore this college at fifth position we have uvce that is university vishveshwaraya college of engineering 
This is the oldest college of Karnataka, established in 1917. NAC accredited, NBA accredited and uh, recognized by AICT, that is All India Council uh, for Technical Education. And uh, you know, all, of the, all the other colleges were also uh, NBA and uh, AICT approved. But uh, UBC is one of the oldest colleges, 100 plus year old college, you know, 103 years turned this 2020. Government college and... Uh, this was speci especially founded by Bharat Ratna uh, Shri uh, Saram Vishweshwaraya. So uh, founded by him and uh, it is the fifth uh, oldest college in the country too. You know the whole country India and it was fifth to be established and first in Karnataka. And it is affiliated to Bangalore University. That is one thing and uh, the infrastructure is old I've heard but uh, an excellent college nevertheless. At fourth position, we have the PES University, that is People's Education Society University. And uh, this uh, college takes admission in two ways, that is, uh, one is uh, KCET, that is Karnataka Common Entrance Test, and the other is PESAT. It's specifically, they've designed their own entrance exam called as PESAT, P-E-S-S-A-T, that is it. And 60% uh, of the seats are reserved for uh, PESAT uh, entrance uh, candidates and 40% for the KCD, uh, KCT applicants. And uh, note that there are no Comet K seats in PES University College. So this is one thing to be noted. And now at the top three. So the third position goes to MSRIT. That is MS Ramaya Institute of Technology. An excellent college, you know, very deserving to be in the top three and uh, autonomous institution, private college and affiliated to VTO again, present in MSR Nagar, Bangalore and uh, very, very good placement records and uh, offers uh, UG, PG and uh, PhD programs and, uh, you know, a really, really good college. And uh, if you're really getting this, this is the one uh, to be chosen. Excellent college. Next, we have at second position that is BMSCE. That is uh, BM Srinivasaya College of Engineering. This is the third oldest in Mysore, uh, sorry, uh, third oldest college in Karnataka and uh, established in 1946, same as NI, but uh, you know, a little later. And uh, its full form, I would like to read it out to you. It is Bhusanayana Mukandadas Srinivasaya College of Engineering, VTO affiliated, autonomy granted, and uh, present in Basavanagudi area of uh, Bangalore. Established 1946 and it offers 13 departments and one special program which it, uh, only two colleges offer in at present in Karnataka, you know, the colleges which we get through common case, CET, etc. is uh, Aerospace Engineering. So this was about uh, BMS College of Engineering, excellent college with, you know, uh, astonishing placement record and uh, all the other thing and uh, uh, co-curricular co co activities are at, at its prime and uh, really good college. And the top uh, number one position uh, goes to, you know, it's been taking this position in everyone's mouth, that is RVCE, that is RV College of Engineering. It's, uh, this is abbrevi abbreviated for Rashtriya Vidyalaya College of Engineering. So, uh, present in, you know, very easy to find this college, you know, uh, Mysore Road, uh, just get into Bangalore and it is on the right side. Mysore or Bangalore and uh, 14 departments and the others, uh, the specifically, uh, this uh, college is known for its aerospace engineering branch. Uh, the other uh, was in uh, BMS college and uh, the, uh, the only other college which provides this discipline is RV College of Engineering. Excellent uh, placement record in this college, supposed to be number one from a you know, lot of years. So I hope uh, you all enjoyed this video and uh, this was my top uh, 25 colleges. We started with colleges such as IIC Bangalore, uh, IIT Dharwad, Triple IT Bangalore, Manipal Institute of Technology, as well as uh, Triple, um, yeah, NIT Suratkal. So these were our top five colleges. Then I gave you a countdown about uh, twenty colleges uh, with uh, you know the the top twenty colleges present in Karnataka, which takes admission through KCET, Comet K, and the only only one is uh, PS University, which takes admission through. PESAT and uh, KCT but not Comet K. So that is a point which is to be duly noted. Uh, another two three colleges if you really want to know is uh, you know Malnad College of Engineering that is present in Hassan and uh, not too preferable but uh, yes if you don't get these 20-25 colleges the next most the most preferable would be these colleges. Another one is PES College of Engineering Mandya so that is uh, near uh, Mysore. Another one is uh, Vidyavardhaka College of Engineering, also present in Mysore. So these are the next preferable colleges apart from these 20. So if you are getting in any of uh, these 20 colleges, I would, uh, uh, you know, congratulate you uh, at the beginning itself. Uh, 
prayer congratulations to all of you if you are getting in any of these colleges karnataka is known for its excellent uh, education in technical uh, field and uh, any of these colleges is a really good choice so thank you for watching this video i thank arindam again for having me here at arc community goodbye and all the best